Everybody gets to live right here. That's so awesome. Wait, two people get to live right here. Got my phone in the bag today. Why it's all weird, like always. Because it was sprinkling. Looks a little funky out. Um, I'm eating these chocolate pretzel pop tarts for breakfast. They're pretty good. Thomas isn't ready yet, so I'm gonna start out without him. We got two big climbs, it looks like today. Should only be going about 14 miles. All right. I'm probably about two miles in, just under, I think. Um, and this is our first big climb of the day. It is like close to 1,800 feet or something, I think, according to gut hooks, if I lined everything up right. So it's kind of a beast in how much climbing we're doing. Um, but that's why we started starting earlier, because it's just too dang hot when the sun comes out. So, hopefully we can make it a good way, good ways before the sun, uh, breaks through the clouds and everything. So, um, Thomas still hasn't caught me yet, so he's... Probably just now leaving or left 15 minutes ago or something. I don't know, just a guess. Anyway, I need my tracking poles. Morning, it is day 69, I believe, and we are heading out. Well, we isn't me, everybody else already left because I wanted to sleep a little longer, even though I didn't really get to. So, we're heading uh, about 14 miles today, should be a fairly easy day. Uh, just because it's lower miles, but we might push on who knows All right, we finally made it to the top of this big hill. It got pretty foggy once we went around the side of this mountain. So we're hoping this will clear up some by the time we get to these cliffs that are supposed to have a nice view. But I don't know, it's kind of looking like it's gonna stay foggy most of the day. What you say? Pass it, Sam. All right, we made it up to the top of Kelly Knob number two. The sign here says view 120 yards but I kind of don't think there's going to be one. That's pretty cool. I'm not gonna go over there, though. It's old, falling apart. It looks like barn or something. Whoop. Um, I'm so exhausted. It's up ahead. Well, we haven't eaten lunch yet. It's almost one o'clock. Um, getting ready to stop. Just trying to find the keeper oak.
I literally just saw Thomas sprint up these stairs from way back there somewhere way past camper I saw him run sprint up these stairs like he hasn't already hiked you know 12 miles nothing 10 10 miles today 30 pound pack on his back majority uphill I do not understand that guy <sighs> oh yeah look at all those steps Walking along this ridge to Sarver's Hollow Shelter. We need to go down there to get some water. We weren't planning on staying there, but we'll see how we feel once we go down and back up. Although, I uh, doubt we're gonna wanna go down, back up, and then back down. But we need to go down there to get water. We were planning on camping just before one of these views so that maybe we could catch a good sunrise or sunset. But it's supposed to be patchy fog tomorrow morning and as you can tell it's pretty foggy today so probably not going to get a view so we'll see if we want to camp there or not these are the bruisers knob cairns you can see these big piles of rocks along here these were supposedly left here by farmers from way back in the day so they could find their way been maybe five or six of them every 10 20 feet or so so it took a lot of work to stack all these rocks up here i'm sure all right since the lows highs and lows are going to be on campers channel today thought i'd let everybody know that these cairns are campers low <laughs> he's very uh unthrilled about them because most of them are knocked over I know there's supposed to be like memorials or monuments, but to what? If anybody knows, it's a ton of them. So just that one was the biggest one. So if anybody knows, feel free to uh, let us know in the comments. Go. All right, should we hang the food bags and then yeah. the camper records highs and lows? <laughs> I think it's your turn. I mean, you don't have to put them on your channel. People, I, whoa, look at the size of that spider. People fast. love them on our channel, Camper, so. Um, people comment all the time on my channel saying that it was such a good job that I came up with that idea. Oh, give me a break. It's all right. Karma will come back around. I'm just saying with her. I, I didn't tell him to say that. But you also didn't tell him not to. I did. I said, well, you know, <laughs> when I brought it up to Wander out there, they said, sure, sounds like a good idea. <laughs> so technically, I'm not lying. Except 100% you did lie. <laughs> <laughs> Technically. <laughs> <laughs>